Well, another good morning to you, just about. It's getting on for midday and uh, hijinks. No sooner had I uploaded the little video, which is just up now about what I did with the Christmas tree, um, that I get a phone call from the Ard Card, Ard Carn Garden Centre to say that the, the gravel that I'd ordered was being delivered today. So at the moment, Paul, who drives for Ard Carn, is um, down there in the big truck, attempting to get the big truck up the driveway. Of course, it's quite a big deal because, uh, you know, the driveway is quite closed in. But then I do put trees before everything else. So we'll see how it goes anyway. So I've just pulled my car forward. So he's hoping to go forward as much as possible in this tight space and then reverse round and then empty the gravel. Um, so fingers crossed he manages to get that done. <laughs> he walked up the driveway actually, it's very good. He walked up the driveway and he said, you know, you know the best way to get this up and to, you know, to deliver it and then uh, he says oh sure we'll see how we go on he says so <laughs> back down to the truck <laughs> and uh, he's coming up very very slowly you can just see um, which is really good of him you know he's coming up slowly because he doesn't want to uh, damage any of the trees but of course the trees are very resilient if the odd branch or whatever gets broken off you know it's not the end of the world as they say so, um, anyway, I'll just move this little bird feeder, look. We don't want that being bashed up. So, anyway, there we go. Um, so it looks as though for most of the rest of today, I am going to be um, scattering gravel. Um, let me just hang this up here. There we go. Now... I think he's finding it difficult enough really because the van is quite wide the truck's quite wide but anyway uh, he's edging forward slowly you know very very you can see just how wide it is can't you But anyway, we'll see how it goes. Of course, I hope he doesn't get stuck on this bit here, which is always a wee bit dicey. I don't want to be stood here filming him with him watching me because it's going to make him a bit more unsettled. I'd rather he concentrate on the, the task in hand. So I'm just going to... Keeps opening and closing the door just to check. Anyway, I'm sure he'll do his best. You can just hear him now. So I'm all prepared. I've got my wellies on. And, uh, Good to go. I have to get stuck into this. Because uh, spreading two tonne of gravel on a narrow driveway uh, takes a fair amount of patience. Because I don't just throw it about anywhere. You know, I try to keep it on the two tracks. And then hopefully there'll be enough left over then to um, spread around the cottage because of course each year um, you know with the rains and the movement of the of the soil in a way because this is something I've noticed that the soil it keeps moving forward now the trees the trees do actually um, stabilize a huge amount of the earth but nevertheless there is a continual movement forward because I'm on a hill. So the gravel does help to 
provide that stability and give it that top dressing, you know, that protects everything underneath. So every, every um, two years at least, I get a delivery of gravel and do this, do this task. Now the little orange light is flashing, so I'm hoping, I'm hoping it'll keep going till we see Paul's, Paul's van emerge here at the top. I'll just pull back a bit. I don't want to make him nervous, you know. So you can just hear him. He's taking his time as best as possible coming up. Not the easiest task in the world. Delivering to somewhere like Belton a cottage. <laughs> Where this crazy woman lives has planted all these trees and uh, instead of having a big open driveway it's all sort of closed in. So I think future deliveries will have to be rethought. I will probably have to have maybe one two ton maybe one bag of gravel delivered annually and put at the bottom of the driveway and then, you know, do it that way. Okay, now the truck is just, there we go, the truck's here. So I'm going to stop now and help direct him. Blessings to you 